Greeting subscribers and other curious persons. Welcome to another vlog inspired by the Goodreads Tuesday Talks group. This week's topic is, do you always read the book before watching the film? Simple answer, no. There are arguments on both sides. It, the book has more in it. It's a more nuanced portrayal, usually, because there's more space in a book. To go, a film is one and a half hours, two hours long. Think of a book that you could read in an hour and a half. Probably, picking a famous book at random, uh, Gone Girl. The film was, let's say, two hours long. Anyone read the book in less than two hours? I suppose some people must have done, but generally, they're a different experience. I read very fast compared to the average, and the length of time it takes me to read a book is usually longer than the length of time a film runs. So films are a shorter in terms of how much story you can fit in. And the story they fit in is fitted in in different ways. The description is lower. Not in terms of there's less to see, in terms of what you are seeing is put before you rather than you forming images of it in your mind. So it's pre-described to coin a term. A character looks the same for every single person. There's no putting your own experiences onto the character. So there's less depth there, which can mean the book is more exciting, more immersive, but also means that potentially it's better not to read the book first. Because you read the book, you love the book, you go to see the film because you love the book, and the casting director disagreed with you about how the character should look, or the producer didn't like a particular substory. They're different media, so I don't view them as being one of them you do first and one of them you do second. It doesn't really matter to me. And most of the time when I'm watching a film, I'm never going to read the book in Avengers. Is there a novelization of that? There certainly wasn't someone who wrote that story. It's cobbled together from a lot of comics, which I might or might not have read some of, but... Usually, I'm treating them as different enough experiences that I don't really think, should I read the book before I see this film or not? So, doodaloo.